2010 white MacBook trackpad replacement. Start off by removing 8 Phillips head screws. This will release the logic board cover. Once the 8 screws are out of the way, gently lift up the cover and move it out of the way. Disconnect the battery first. Battery removal. Start off by removing the three Phillips head screws at the bottom of the battery. Now you can remove the three tri-wing screws at the top of the battery. The one in the far left is hidden behind a piece of tape. Pull up on the battery and remove it out of the way. Trackpad removal. Disconnect the trackpad from the logic board. Now unscrew four screws, two on each side of the trackpad corners. Make sure you unscrew the outer screws, not the two black inner ones. Open the MacBook while it's laying down and pull the trackpad out of its socket. Trackpad reinstallation. Open up the MacBook and tuck in the trackpad, going towards you first and then pushing it up. Reinstall the four Phillips head screws securing the trackpad, but do not tighten them all the way. Lift up and adjust the trackpad so that it's centered. Now you can tighten the four screws. Reconnect the trackpad to the logic board. Battery reinstallation. Insert the battery at an angle and drop it into the socket. Reinstall the three Phillips head screws at the bottom of the battery. Now reinstall the three tri-wing screws at the top. Reconnect the battery. You can now place the logic board cover back on. Secure it with eight Phillips head screws. It is good to perform an SMC reset after this procedure.